Jackson, our editors, our executive producers, Lana Garland. I have too many people, I'm going to forget the names, but really what I want to say is just thank you for watching the film, taking the time to look at it. Um, you'll, the more you learn or after you've seen it and maybe heard some of what we said in our Q&As, I mean, this has been a battle for truth. I mean, we've, you're looking at a whistleblower right here who's brave enough to stand up against this system. And they were really trying to railroad him and I managed to earn his trust and enough people to uh, get inside the story a lot deeper than a lot of the sources I had expected because those of you who saw the film saw that a lot of them revealed themselves on camera um, and the story sort of played out in front of our camera and it was one of those rare situations when I mean this was a true indie project it's my first ever documentary I got a book contract, I've been a journalist my whole career, and I recognized this right in front of me as I was trying to uncover what had happened in this shooting that had transformed and changed the whole neighborhood, that actually what was happening in front of me was revealing exactly that, and so I started filming. And thanks to everyone who supported it, thanks to all of you for seeing it, and I'd like to give Chance a word as well. Thank you. Can I ask you guys if you, as I present Julian's award to him, because this is his award, can I give, we all know how important documentary filmmaking is, that's why we're all here today, to all the filmmakers that are here, doing movies like Bad Acts, doing movies like Woodhood, really exposing corruption, getting kids out of the inner city, you are saving lives, you are lifesavers, documentary film is so important, there is a lot of things going on, so can we give Julian a round of applause as I present this award? Yeah! Woo! I have a joke. If I was running for mayor, tell you right, I would have get elected, but it's easier said than done. So whoever said Robert's from here, thank you very much. But. Saturday was the first time I woke up with a hangover with a smile on my face. <laughs> I got like 25 hugs on Friday and like 10 beers and drinks, but I just want to say thank you to the town of Telluride for just your hospitality, just your spirit, just the smiles on your face, just your perseverance. I love this place. I love Colorado. I'm Colorado everything. I just want to say thank you guys, and I want to give a special thank you to my friend, my mentor, and to a very brave person who saved in lives, Julian Rubenstein. So thank you so much. Um, I should have mentioned that also comes with a $5,000 award. Congratulations. Well, thank you so much for your kind patience.